For those of you using Canva to make your videos, they have three new transitions. For those of you who know nothing about the transitions, I'll go through all of them. There are nine of them in there, but I'm specifically going to show you two of the new ones that are awesome. And you definitely want to check them out. Let's get over there and make this a short video. Short and sweet, right? Get right to the point. <clears throat> We're going to go over here to Canva. You're going to go under Create a Design, hit Video. Now I'm going to go under Video Templates so that I can get one that's already made. And I'm going to apply all seven pages so we have a classroom template. I thought that was with it being the beginning of the school year. I'm getting ready to start teaching next week. Uh, it'll be a good thing. I do teach online, so a lot of this stuff will definitely come in handy. All right, so transitions are when you're going from one screen to the other, obviously. And basically, we're going to turn this video on. And you can see that when it goes to the next slide, it just kind of, you know, goes over. So let's see what transitions that we can add. We're going to go back to slide one. And to get to the transitions, you want to look in between the slides. And these already have transitions. I just picked one that happened to have them, but that's still okay. You can change them. So what I did is I just clicked this little plus sign and I added a page and or here I can just change the transition. Okay. So I don't really need to add the page. I'm going to delete that. I just want to change this transition. See that? change transition. So I'm going to go ahead and click change transition. And then I'm going to go over here. And these are all the different transitions. Right now, um, there's a circle wipe. See how that just did that when it went over? And um, we can do a line wipe, match and move, slide, which everybody's familiar with. And what I would like about the slide is you have the ability to slide it from any direction. You can bring it in from the right, from the left, from the bottom, and from the top. So that's pretty cool. I know my editing tool does not do that. I have to just bring it in one way. All right, you can also change your duration. So let's slide going up. Look at that, it takes a little bit longer. All right, here's uh, a couple others that have been here a while, just to show you real quick. Circle, wipe, see that? And again, you can change the duration, make it last a long, little longer, see that? So it's really effective. And this is a line wipe. We did that earlier. This is a new one, match and move. So it kind of just fades in and fades out. Now, these are the two that I really want you to look at. This one is stack. All right. And it's kind of like a slide, but not quite. It's more of the whole thing moving as a whole page instead of just getting that slide effect. Watch it as it comes up. It's the whole page coming up, almost like a stack, like you're putting a card on top of another. And here it is coming down. Again, you can do it quickly. There's your duration. We'll make it shorter. I like the up and down, up and down. All right, this one is the best one. Chop, watch what it does. It's gonna chop it down. <laughs> and you can come in from the left and you can come in from the right. And we can make it last just a little bit longer, give it more of an effect. See that boom, chop and chop. So from the top actually, and from the bottom. And these will all change the location. See where the little corner, the dot in the corner is? So that one's gonna come in from the top and from the bottom, from that corner. And here's another one. See how you can just change it any way you want. And that's it. Those are the transitions for the video. And just watch as you go through. You'll see your new transition. Here comes the chop. And then there are other transitions that are already here on this particular one. All right. And you can use these templates to change the, the text and, and just use it as a template. Well, just like it says. And um, uh, make it your own. So definitely... Check these out. If you'd like to make videos, this is the easy way to do it. Thank you. Tell me which one was your favorite. Mine's the chop, I have to say. I thought that was pretty cool. All right, guys, give me a thumbs up. Let me know what you think in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe. And you have a blessed day. I'll see you on the next video.